All right, I'm finna name y'all four things that weak women let their partner get away with. And if you can relate to any of these four things, yes, I'm calling you a weak woman. But it's okay, we can fix that. Number one is a girl that try to convince herself that social media is not that big of a deal. This is where we get into the pick me's, okay? This is a girl that has convinced herself that it doesn't mean anything that he likes other girls' pictures all the time. It doesn't mean anything that he follow all these OnlyFans models and Instagram models. It doesn't mean anything that he never posts you and he claims to want to live a private life. It just Instagram is made to like pictures. So do you know you're not okay with that? You know deep down there's something wrong with that, bro. Like, and then like look at the day and age, bro. Social media is the easiest way to cheat. That's that's probably step one. If it ain't the workplace, you being weak, okay? That man is micro cheating on you. And I can I bet my last dollar, he gonna end up cheating, cheating for real. Number two is the woman that allowed her man to just disappear off the face of the earth with no update, no communication, nothing. It's been five, six hours, and that man has not updated you with what's going on. He has not told you where he's at, what he's doing, what he plan on doing, what time he plan on coming home. And your response is, he just a guy. He is out with the guys. He handling responsibility. He being a man. No, that man is out there doing you the worst way, shot. I promise. You know your man, right? And I, I know your man. When does he never not have his phone on him? When is his phone ever dying? When is it never not charged up? Like my phone died, bro. That I had to go crash in my partner house, and I just woke up at four thirty, found the charge, and now I'm texting you. If you believe that, you a weak woman. Three is when this man feelings are involved, when his emotions are evoked, when he's upset, you excuse his shitty ass behavior. I'm gonna give y'all some games. A peep. You do not judge a man by how he treats you when he's happy with you, or how well y'all did in the cupcake phase of the beginning. You wanna know how a man feel about you? How he handle you when he mad? Well, you done pissed him off. Because it's going to happen. I mean, that's 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 inevitable. But how he talk about you then? How he talk to you then? What's his tone? What do he say? There's no such thing. No such thing as I just said that because I was mad. Please, like, if you believe that you was a weak woman, you a weak man if you believe that bullshit for real. It's like that shit was brewing in them this entire time. And now they done, you done stir their ass up so much that they got word vomit. Or shit, they may, may have said it intentionally to, to hit a nerve. Four is the woman that allows her man to not show any type of effort. You don't require this man to meet any standards, okay? Listen to this. Your love that you have for your man should be unconditional. But being in a relationship with you is very much conditional. It's, my boy, you got, it's, it's rules, guidelines. This shit was all in the goddamn, you know what I'm saying? What's it called? What's it called? Table of contents shit is in the terms and conditions okay you have got to treat me like a queen and if you don't we are done straight like that that's it so if you're a woman and you got a man or you dating somebody and you allowing this shit to slide stop being weak bro cut that shit out